today topic is implantable drug delivery system classification in that classification the second type that is oral osmotic drug delivery system how does the drug deliver from the oral osmotic route here we can observe the oral osmotic pump this oral osmotic pump is delivered divided into three categories that is such as single chamber multi chamber and specific type of the osmotic pump in single chamber the elementary osmotic pump is used this elementary osmotic pump is constructed by the coating of osmotically active agents this membrane sorry this elementary osmotic pump is coated by the osmotically active agent with the rate of controlling semi permeable membrane this membrane contains orifice that size which is used to, to deliver the drug the drug release through this system can occur in the control of the water penetration characters after the water can penetration the semi permeable sorry the water can be transferred through the semi permeable membrane of the drug and the osmotic properties of the osmogen in the formulation the dosage form after coming into contact with the aqueous fluids to imbibe with the water to form the fluid permeability this elementary osmotic pump imbibitions of the water it results in the formation of the saturated solution this saturated solution of the drug which is dispensed at the control rate to form the delivery of the membrane after the delivery of the drug into the membranes 60 to 80% of the drug which is released into the elementary osmotic pump after the releasing of this drug into elementary osmotic pump it takes 60 to 80 minutes to absorb in the most cases of the skin or body this system is mostly suitable for the delivery of drugs which is having moderate water solubility this is about the elementary osmotic pump i will show the picture also i will share the picture here it is this is the elementary osmotic pump this is the delivery orifice and this is the semi permeable membrane and this one is core containing agent and in multi osmolytic drug delivery system contains push pull osmotic pump in this push pull osmotic pump in this push pull osmotic pump it is modified as a elementary osmotic pump and in this push pull osmotic pump water soluble drugs are the water soluble according to sorry in addition to the water soluble drugs it contains excipients and polymeric osmotic agents which has the ability to form a suspension of the drug these layers are formed separately and bonded together to form the single bilayer a small hole is a small hole is drilled through the membrane by laser or mechanical drill to deliver the drug okay this is the delivery orifice when these two systems are placed in aqueous environment the water is attached into the tablet by osmotic agent in both layers 
the osmotic attraction in the drug layer pulls the water into compartment to form the suspension of the drug this is about the push and pull osmotic pump after moving the third one osmotic pump with non expanding second chamber in this osmotic pump the second category of the multi chamber devices compresses system containing non expanding second chamber this group can be divided into two subgroups which is depend upon the function of second chamber in the first device the chamber which is used to dilute the drug solution which released into the body at certain cases where the drug is released in the concentrated form it causes the problem of irritation in the gi tract by the release of the concentration of the drug it causes gi irritations in second devices there are rigid chambers where in the first one it contains a biologically inert osmotic agent such as sugar or simple salt but in the second chamber it contains the drug so the water is drawn into both chambers through the semi permeable membrane this solution of the osmotic agent which is formed in the first chamber and then it passes through the connecting hole to the drug chamber after the mixing of the drug solution it exist through the microporous membrane the de these device this osmotic pump with the non expanding second chamber device is used to deliver the insoluble drugs and in this osmotic drug delivery system the similar system which is related to the elementary osmotic pump that is bursting osmotic pump this bursting osmotic pump the delivery of the drug in the small medium when it placed in the aqueous environment the water is imbibed through the semi permeable membrane and it built up the inside of the membrane which ruptures the content to releasing of the drug after the releasing of the drug it can be varied by the thickness and area of the semi permeable membrane this system is mostly useful to provide the pulsated drug release in the pulsate pulsatile drug delivery system it contains a lot of interest as they deliver the drug at right side of the action at the right time at the right time at the right amount at the right side the drug can be delivered into the skin or body in this pulsatile drug delivery system it is it provide a spatial and temporal delivery of the drug with increasing patient compliance in this system this system is designed according to the circadian rhythm of the body the principle of the main pulsatile drug delivery system is drugs constantly release the zero order to the not desired the release of the drug at pulse after a long time it has to be designed in a such a way that a complete and rapid drug release can be follows in a long time it takes long time to release the drug delivery in the body this type of tablet system consists core coated with the two layers of swelling swelling and rupturable coatings for these swelling and rupturable coatings 
the spray dried lactose and microcrystalline cellulose are used to decode the spelling polymer another one is liquid oral osmotic system in this liquid oral osmotic system it is designed to deliver the drugs as in liquid formulations most of the liquid formulations are delivered into the body through the implants by using this liquid oral osmotic system these are three types that is liquid oral root osmotic system and capsules these are available in the hard capsule forms and soft capsule forms and also liquid oral osmotic system also these are in a three forms you can observe here this is the liquid oral soft capsules these two are these are the hard capsules of the liquid oral osmotic system after this multi particulate delayed release osmotic system in this system the drug released into the body with or without osmotic agents which are coated with the cellulose as stated the osmotic pressure gradient increase the water reflux it results in the rapid expansion of the membrane which leads to form the pores in this multi particulate delayed release osmotic system the drug released into the body lately means it takes some time long period of time so that's why it is called as delayed release the delayed release of the drug into the body by the multi particulate multi particulates of the cells here you can observe the diagram of the multi particulate drug delivery delayed release system next one is telescope capsule delayed release this is a bilayered osmotic tablet when one chamber is containing drug and another chamber containing osmotic engine the filling of drug either performed manually or automated filling machines these two layers are separated by the waxy material this tablet is fitted inside a capsule in such a way that osmotic layer of 